playing the NCAA tournament at home means a lot because we worked really hard to get to this place and we won it the first two rounds and we got it. So now it's just like we know the Colonial Life Arena is going to be packed and we're trying to uh, win both rounds without a doubt and try to have our fans behind our back. Uh, being able to play the first few games at home I think will be really good. I mean, this is my last year and just to be able to play a few more games in front of a home crowd, play on our home court um, one more time, one or two more times for the first round is just really a good experience. I know a lot of um, teams don't get to play at home their first round and, you know, their seniors won't get to play on their home court again. So just to see these fans and embrace the fans for a few more games is just really exciting and I'm grateful that we can do that this year. It I, it's a great feeling. I mean, why wouldn't you want to play with one of the best? I mean, the best fans in the country. I mean, their their support system is crazy, and I know they're going to fill this arena up to the top, especially after winning that game. And they, we we really feed off their energy, uh, believe it or not. And just to say we can have two of those games and feel comfortable, like it may maybe knock some of the nerves off the the, the younger ones. Um, it's going to build the older ones up, and it's going to build us up. And just having that here is just going to be a great feeling. It would mean a lot. I mean, our fan support this whole season has been, you know, crazy. We have some huge uh, and great fans here that support us, you know, through thick and thin when things are we're losing or probably at halftime or we're getting a drought. You know, the fan support here just brings us back to life. And I think it's plays a, like a six man on the court for us. So I think it's a really challenging place to play when uh, our fans are top notch. It means the world to me to play it at home. I mean, I've just grown up filling out my brackets, you know, just kind of being a little girl, just like, oh, I'm going to have such and such win, oh, I'll have to lose it. But to really kind of be a part of it now and having little girls fill out brackets for, like, our team, it's crazy. And then let alone we're playing at home with a great crowd that we love so much. Our fans are amazing. I love them so much. But just playing in front of them for and letting them come and spend time with us and coming to see us play postseason is just great. So, I mean, it, it really means a lot. It really does. It's going to mean a lot because I've been a part of a lot of NCAA tournament games that have been very far away from home. Um, you know, been a part of a lot of games who have, that have been played on, you know, our opponent's home court. So to be able to kind of have the tables turned a little bit and for us to be in that position, you know, with our fans supporting what we've been able to have, you know, with our fans all season, um, you know, it, 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 I think it's fitting and especially fitting for me in my senior year, um, you know, for everything that's been able to happen this year. Um, and to kind of cap it off with we get to play the first two rounds of the tournament at home. Um, you know, it's just, it falls right into place. Like I've been saying all season, you know, just kind of check off the bucket list as you go as things you wanted to be able to say you've been able to accomplish in your senior year.